Okay, so Katas is just coming downstairs here, and she saw through the glass that that door is open. And she does not want to go in there, but she trusts me. She will go in there if I am here. But, uh, yeah, she needs to know when she can do it and when not. I prefer if she does not come in here. I don't think she will. And also, the dogs will chase her out. And uh, Enzo is right here. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, just look at that face, how she's thinking about this. That's how she thinks about it. Should she go in or not? But, let's see if she crosses this line. I don't think she's going to... She knows what is in here. And there's no way that I will allow her in here if I'm not here. Enzo? But yeah, she has not come in here yet. I don't think she wants to. Let's see that. Thinking about it. No, she is not coming in here yet. <laughs> ah, she'd rather go back. Now that's where you want it. You don't want them to. Well, they are so relaxed, those two. Because they've never had that problem. But cut us, she has. And let's see that. I don't think she's going to, but she could. She does not want to cross that line. Well, the nose has crossed the line, but the feet are still on that side. Enzo. <laughs> yeah, Katas, rather stay that side. Well, Katas is right here in my car. And she wants to spend some time with me here. Yes, we are waiting for Jackie, who is taking her time. We want to go to town and get back. But yeah, Katas is keeping me company right here. Jackie is wearing a tiger eye gift. And uh, we're standing in the row right here to quickly buy some data. So I can load my videos tonight, but it's quite busy here at the mall. Just look at this. A lot of people. And you should see the outside with all the cars. I think everybody came here with two cars today. Okay, so I'm going to take care of this cold my way. And I've had experience of that before. I once had a cold, got off a plane, and it was terrible. And I had two beers. And it solved it. So, I'm no doctor. It worked that day. So, I'm going to have a pizza right at the mall. And I'm going to have one beer, not two. And we'll see. Maybe it, maybe it works. Pizza is here. It's absolutely great. This cold is not going to make it past this. So, let me get started. I think I'm going to get one of these. And we'll see what the Tigers reaction is when I show up with this on. I think it's going to be great. Drinking straw. Yeah, this is going to be perfect. Can you believe it? Now just check this out. This can definitely work longer than the electronic part will last. Well, you need one of these to check out for elves this year if you are going to put up a tree just to see who brings the presents. Yeah, the little ones are all sleeping right there. They are having so much relaxed time. Just look at it. They are so comfortable with one another and the little black and white one is right between <laughs> well these little friends. So 
Chris is looking at. They're amazing. <laughs> Zach is right here. So the pool is clean. Enzo is waiting. He wants to go in here. Enzo key. And Diego as well. So we better get this thing going. Let me just show you guys. Well, pool absolutely cleaned out. And the whole place is clean. Leaves picked up. Not all of it, but well, as much as possible. Little nest right here. There's a couple of nests right there. And I'm going to quickly open up the water to get the pool filled up again. I'll fill it halfway. These cycads over here. There you can see pushing out new leaves. Just look at this one over here. Pushed out a lot of new leaves. And yeah. Well, let me go and open up the water so the tigers can come and play. Let's just see where is Enzo there. Zach! Oh, yes, Zach. Zachis! <laughs> Enzo! <laughs> He's ready to go and play. Diego! so much space <laughs> but in any case let me go and open up that water they want to come and swim okay so they've broken a few planks right here I'm gonna quickly fix it up as far as I can I'm not gonna put in a lot of effort I just knocked in all the nails to make sure there's nothing sharp well, over there and then let me see what I can do you know, I'm not gonna work very hard right now but I have to at least have it safe for the tigers so I'm gonna have to do it they wanted to come in here already but they're just gonna have to wait a little longer it won't take long maybe another 30 minutes Enzo another 30 minutes is that okay okay he said it's fine This is where this one is out. I don't even know where it is. It's just out. So I'll just put that in there. And just move it up a bit. That'll be perfect. This one is also broken. And I think I'm just going to put this one in there. I'm just going to have to remove that one first. Because if his foot goes through there, it could be a problem. Okay, so that first chlorine is diluted enough now to let the tigers in. But... I'm done with this. I've put in two new planks. It was more work than I thought it was going to be, but it's done at least. So I'll finish the rest later, like that one over there. But yeah, they like to watch. Enzo loves to watch whatever is going on on that side through that hole. So I might just leave that there. But yeah, let me get this old wood out of here and uh, get the tigers in. Okay, cats and dogs are on that side. They are all safe. And let me open up for these two boys. Enzo with a quick thank you. Diego with a quick thank you. And let's go see what have I done there, Diego. 
Enzo is like always straight to the pool and he disappears. <laughs> Diego taking his time. He's done this before. He's done this a few times before. He's just going to walk around slowly, check it out. Well, I guess I better get upstairs to see Enzo. All the cats around here. And there is Enzo. Right down there. I'm going to close up for the boys because they're just going to make a noise if they come out now. Let's see what they do. They should be playing. That's why I dilute the chlorine first. Well, as far as I can, before I open up for the tigers. That toy that was sent the other day. That tire. Well, I think it got lost in the pool and Diego couldn't find it. And now it's out again, so he was checking it out just now. Diego's gonna show us some teeth. He just needs to find something to smell first, but he'll find it. Check Enzo out first. Diego seems like he wants to go up. Well, they saw me do something there. He just wants to make sure he didn't miss something at the bottom. He's not drinking it, he's just tasting it. Okay, now he's drinking it. No, not really. He's just tasting it. There he goes. Asking me about the doves. Oh, there they are. Always there. Diego knows exactly where I worked because I just cut a corner off that lawn over there and he knows about it now I'm not sure if he can smell that I was there but yeah there is the teeth maybe you leave a scent behind everywhere you touch and they know exactly how to recognize it Enzo's just checking everything out from that side now Diego hasn't seen the top part of his jungle gym yet where I've replaced the two planks He'll go up in a minute. Enzo's gonna just smell the tree and then rub all against it. Yeah. 
That's how he does it. And Diego. He's got that funny look on his face. But then again, he's always got that funny look on his face. All the cats and dogs watching the tigers right over here. They just want to make sure that the tigers don't do anything funny. Okay, I think Diego's gonna go up. Something is telling him to go and check the planks. No, he changed his mind. Or did he? I'm sure you can smell that I've touched that corner right there where he was smelling now. So he knows that I was up there. sure that I didn't mess around over there. Enzo still in the pool. Diego's gonna go that side. Now he sees that. Where's that hole? He was sure that there was a hole there before and now it's gone. And you don't know if he liked it there. Maybe it was difficult to lie down there comfortably. But maybe he just loved it. <laughs> you just don't know. Well anyway, it's repaired. Because if you don't repair it immediately, that whole thing starts falling apart. Especially when they play, if they're up there and they run, a, a run and jump and do their thing. Well talking about doing their thing. Well then they just tear that whole jungle gym apart. So I've learned if something is wrong on it, fix it immediately. Because it's not gonna stay in good condition for longer than a day or two if there is some yeah Enzo I can see the coloring. He's sliding down. <laughs> yeah, that's what I get for putting new water in the pool for them. Well, now I'm going to put less water in because I'll rather take a little bit of water out again in a week and fill it up after he's done that because yeah, there's a big stain in the water right now now it's going to probably pull his face but let's just check Diego there <laughs> okay so Pete left his phone out and Billy got hold of it. So he's trying to take out the buttons right now. So I have to try and get him to hand it over. Because if you take it, he's angry at you. But if he will hand it over, that would be just great. But let me just see how I can do this. Maybe I could just so. <laughs> ask him nicely to give it. but. He's so impressed with himself. I don't think we're going to be able to get it from him. Let me see what I can do. Billy! Come here, so Billy. He slept over last night. So, 
just trying to. I'm, I'm going to have to snatch that phone away from him, but he's not going to be impressed with me. In fact, I think he's going to be really angry. Okay, so we just swapped him for that phone. And then I'll take this one. Right, and now he's got his own phone. <laughs> That's a nice thing about if you've got your own brand of cell phone. You've got a lot of them. And then that's an old one that we had. Just swapped him straight up. And Pete's got his phone back. Okay, still putting his pants back on. <laughs> and uh, he's taking buttons out of the phone. Hmm, he's going to take it apart. So little Bella just needs to come to the exit to get out of the enclosure. But she wants us to take her out right there. She's just not understanding that she needs to go to the exit. So, there she is. Played the whole, oh, probably about an hour. And now she's had enough. She wants out. Well, she's not a cage monkey. She's one of those monkeys that do whatever they want. Bella. <laughs> Annie. Bella wants to come out, but she hasn't yet. Yeah, okay, now she's at least coming into this enclosure. Then we can take her out. Arnie's right here. Seriously, Arnie, is there ever a second that you don't eat? He just eats all the time. Dogs are just running around playing. Hello, Bella. <laughs> Zia! Go and see. Twins. There's Enzo. Arthur. Diego. <laughs> Enzo. <laughs> Enzo. <laughs> yeah, what you have to be careful for, if you've got your hands in by a tiger, it's not only that they can take your finger, but if they press your finger against that wire, they can break it. So that's really painful. But be very careful about that. But in any case, I've got to go get their food ready. They will be eating within the next few minutes. And, uh, well, all of them will be eating within the next few minutes. Little opal over there. Water running into the pool. Vegetarian cat just chilling right there. Let's just quickly, let me just go up. should be around about there. There they are. <laughs> Water's running into the pool and the tigers are just walking their walks. A little bucky over there. Yeah, and that's basically the end of the day when the sun is that low.
goes down quite quick. Well, it, not as quick as in the winter time, but it goes down a bit quick. That was a good day. So, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed that. And like always, have a good day.